Yo, know, what's going on guys, it's Kaden and the Telephone Zone here, back with another video. This is my UAPB Week 1. Sorry about the delay, uh, Crimson HV, who is supposed to be my matchup. Uh, actually had to drop out of the league. I'm not going to talk about why. It's not exactly important. Personal issues and shit. And then the replacement came in, and he grabbed the wrong Crimson team. I don't know, I could... Technically, I argue that it should be a forfeit because he knew my team and I had to re-prep, which is extremely sucky. I didn't change too much, but I wish I had the team I had before. And of course, I actually didn't change many of my sets because I was too lazy to, and it might have cost me. Whatever. Let's get into my team. So, actually, let me pull it up. Actually, you'll just see the team he has. I think it was a uh, McGear and a Mega Maw team. No, not Mega Maw, Mega Medicham. And Hollywood. It's basically the three threats. And I just under prepped. He also had Hydreigon and shit. Um, and if you look at his team, you can. My original team had uh, Rampardos on it. Which pretty much beat this entire team, to be honest. It was Sky for Rampardos. I'm pretty sure it beat pretty much everything. Except for Nintendo it's been the Hollywood, but. Like, I just brought it into a bench or something like Heliolisk and picked up a kill every time. Um, but yeah, so I end up with Gengar, so Sash Gengar. And I don't know why I put Sash on it, it's more for Destiny Bond shenanigans. And, like I said, I just try to mess things around. It was on my original team. What I, haven't, I don't even know what I had in this spot. Uh, Swallow. Oh, speaking of names, uh, so nicknames. Gengar is 3 Spooky 5 Me. Because memes. Uh, Swallow is Chuck, named after the yellow bird and angry birds. Lux Trust is Trypophobia. I'm not even going to talk about what that is. Search it up. Uh, actually, I actually haven't decided to make a lot by name. If you want to try and, you know, think of one, put, put it in the comment below and I might choose it. There's probably only one comment, so you have a strong chance. Uh, then we have On Fleek, my Darmanitan, because look at those eyebrows. And we got Tapu Fini, which is Fini Shim. Okay, so. So I said Sash, Destiny Bond, Sludge Wave, Shadow Ball, Dark Pulse for on Gengar. Swallow was Heat Wave, Air Slash, Boom Burst, U Turn. This is like standard stuff. I was doing Assault Vest, Electros with some Spidaff investment. I've probably. I actually used mostly just 252, actually, other than Electros. I think they're all 252 because I didn't care enough. It, I was supposed to battle like a week ago and then family started having like stuff happening at my house, like birthday parties and school and then Crimson dropped out and I didn't really care enough to like make my pep look good. Megalopony, which is running drain punch over high jump kick because everyone runs protect. Uh Scarf Darm for Earthquake Spam and Tapu Fini. Which now have skulls for some reason, don't know. So yeah, that's it right there. Um, so we fade out first turn here's Rocky Helmet. Uh I sort of want this thing I assumed he'd get up rocks or something, but I just wanted this thing because it has gauge and stuff. And I was so close to making my flamethrower plate. And you can see this didn't matter actually at all. Or not flamethrower, T bolt. But whatever. And um yeah, it didn't matter to enough at all. My lot is gonna get a revenge kill though. Yay. Goes Dawn Fan. I go into Tapu Fini. Click Nature's Madness. Goes for Gunk Shot. Pretty good prep on his part. I honestly didn't even think of Gunk Shot on this thing. I go Swallow. He goes McGinn. I went Heat Wave. I made the play. But it's Assault Vest. I suck. And then I go Gengar. He goes for Volt Switch. Right into, into the Heligo, and Psy Shock, Psy Shock, Psy Shock, Psy Shock. I mean, did Fake Out even do enough for me to argue that I could have faked out it? I don't think it did. 18%. Yeah, no, I couldn't have. Whatever, so that's gonna do it for UAPB. It's an upsetting loss. Completely upsetting. Um, but, honestly, I feel like I should have been able to better. I didn't have too much time. Again, shout out to this guy for stepping in 
than playing with not very much time. And I don't know. It's not necessarily upsetting because I lost, for example. But it's more also because we did. He did choose the wrong team. It's just a whole bunch of stuff in combination that made this somewhat upsetting of a game. But it's the game we play, so gotta live with it. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you with week number two. I will have a team builder out with a, a layout probably by that time. I know I have my battle layout ready. I don't know if, I, if my team builder will be done by that or not. But yeah, I'll see you then, which would be Saturday and Sunday. Goodbye.